Hello, my name is Martin and this is 3D Printing Iceland. In this episode of Make a Box Mondays, I'm going to have a look at a PETG filament from Atomic Filament. It's a carbon fiber extreme blood PETG, so carbon fibers infused PETG. So let's have a look after the intro. So here on the text they say it uh, prints at 240 to 265 and bed temperature 60 to 72 and I was printing at 240 with great results for this filament and they say here it may be abrasive considered hard to nozzle and I believe when you have carbon fibers <laughs> you should use a hard to nozzle but on the, on the label here they say it's a patchy blend with a carbon fiber fill prints with a deep black, slightly textured surface and no transparency. Filament and part are not brittle like some other carbon fiber products. Excellent for professional looking technical prints. And engineering grade patchy resin with US made premium milled carbon fiber, not dust or powder. So that might be some something different than some other guys are doing it. I don't, I don't know the processes. But the uh, state here, it's milled, not powder or dust. So it might, it might have some other properties than normal carbon fiber infused filaments. Uh, um, it's from Atomic Filament in the US. Let's look at the prints. So here was the first test, like a stringing test. And it came out really good. No stringing to speak of. Uh, the, the strands are pretty strong, even though they're very thin. It takes quite some effort to, to break it apart, so it sure is, it's, it's tough. Uh, this normally can break very easily, but it's quite difficult to break. Here on the overhang test at 70 degrees, it has some different textures on it, like you see, but uh, it's not, not so bad. But So overhang performance is pretty cool. And even though the fan, I was using a fan at like 20%, and it's pretty good overhang performance. And it was quite difficult to, to break. And here's a Benchy printed out. And here I had a little bit of cooling issue because of no fan or very little part cooling. But that's maybe expected. But other, other than that, uh, the windows and the doors are pretty good, so overhang performance is really good, even though it's very little fan speed for, for part cooling. So this pencil was looking awesome. Then I printed my maker coin, and that came out excellent and absolutely no issues. I uh, love the, the texture of the filament. You can't really see any layer lines because of the textures uh, with the carbon fiber. It's really, really nice. So. You can see the shine of it, and you can see on the side it's difficult to see any any layer lines. So that came out excellent. And then sear layers a lot. That also came out excellent. And for a patchy, uh, I would expect a little bit more stringing, but there are absolutely no stringing with this filament. It's just coming out perfect, and the surface texture and, and print quality with this filament is excellent. So like you saw on the on samples, I had really good experience with this filament. The PETG uh, Carbon Fiber Extreme Black PETG from Atomic Filament. It was giving me excellent results, and you can get your hands on for this filament. I would highly recommend it. With the test prints I did, uh, at least I was getting excellent print quality and, and, and good layer adhesion as well. And um, that's something that hasn't been very very high for Apache, but for this filament it has pretty good layer adhesion. So I was really happy with this filament. So this will be it for this video. I hope you liked this video and give it a thumbs up and like and share and subscribe and all that. <laughs> but for now this will be it. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.